Hi guys. <laughs> oh, under the wire tonight. Under the wire. Um, I got home a lot later than I planned. By the time I got home I was exhausted and I ended up falling asleep. And now it's 20 past 11 and I'm only just getting Vlogmas Day 8 done. But hey, we're here. Vlogmas Day 8. And it's going to be a short one because I planned a short one. Which is probably a good idea. So today I'm doing a little artist appreciation shout out type thing. Hello Arthur. Uh, this is for Mickey Wilde over on Instagram. Mickey's a friend of mine. She's a UK artist. And I've said before that we there was a bunch of us who started out kind of um, helping out on Willowing's site, on Tam's site, uh, doing little classes here and there. Uh, she did a similar thing to what I did when I started, which was she gave other artists a platform to do a small workshop to try it out, to see what they thought of it and so on. And uh, Mickey was one of those artists. Uh, Mickey now teaches as well, uh, but she is a prolific artist i think she pretty much paints one a day uh, because she's always posting new stuff on instagram and i know recently she's been posting extra stuff because she's been doing things for a specific auction uh i don't remember the name of the auction i'm sorry but you can find out all about it i've put all of her links down here in the description you, so you can find her on Instagram, sign up for her newsletter. She sends out regular newsletters to update you, uh, gives out discounts for her Etsy shops. She posts on Instagram stories a lot of her work on progress and things like that. Um, you can also follow her blog and she's also on Facebook. So she's everywhere. Go find her. But her Instagram, her Instagram is beautiful. So let me show you a couple of things that she's got coming up in the new year. Uh, I, I quite often give her a shout out on Instagram. Um, I enjoy giving shout outs to other UK artists who do original works and sell them because I know there's a lot of people in the UK who often think, oh, I really wish I could get a piece, an original piece by somebody that I really like the paintings of. But often you find, especially in our community, they're over in America or they're out in Australia and it's just not practical to be able to get an original. So Mickey does sell originals. Go check out her Etsy. Here's some of her work that's coming up in January. Um, she sent me, this was a little thank you, basically, for giving her shout outs and stuff on Instagram. So I thought I would show you what she sent me. This is just a postcard that she um, added. Um, and this, she hasn't asked me to do this by the way, she'll probably be horrified. <laughs> these are some of her upcoming pieces. Now these are prints, obviously. She did some pieces for an auction and all of the original, I think all the originals sold and now she's running prints of them next year. I'm not sure if they'll be limited edition or not. Sign up for her newsletter and you'll be able to find out. But look at these beauties. These are, I think these prints are the original size. I know she does larger stuff. She does smaller stuff. Um, she's done some that are quite large, like 8 by 10 type stuff. Uh, I know the, the, I think it's a deer on a green background um, in the auction. It's, her, it's one of her latest highlighted blog posts. Anyway, go over there and you can see all of the ones that she did for the auction. And they are stunning really stunning this is a moth a lunar moth and she does this uh, motif all the way through this flowers flowers and leaves motif this is on all her pieces or all the pieces for this auction anyway I think this was a series for the auction it's a pair of owls snowy owls Aren't they beautiful? This is possibly one of my favourites she's ever done. I think this one, the fir very first wolf she did, because uh, he had kind of a cheeky smirk on his face and I really liked it. And um, she's done one that's bright, bright, bright blue with a polar bear. And I think those are probably my three favourites that she's ever done. So I was 
I was so happy that she sent me one of these. This is awesome. The beautiful colours. This is a deer. So she doesn't always do bright in your face colours. She does quite a range of things. So there's something from everybody's taste. This is quite a, a toned down muted one. And again, this is one that I absolutely love. Isn't he beautiful? I like the way, well, I like the, I like the scribbly backgrounds and, and extra little pieces that she puts in. I love the fact that sometimes she'll just throw in a random piece of collage. Uh, like for instance, it would be quite typical of her to have omitted this and just put this in as a random piece of patterned paper. Um, but I like the way that she does strange things like putting that pink there but if if that pink wasn't there the raven wouldn't stand out so i'd like the little quirks that she adds to things that just makes them a little bit different this deer's got three ears that's fairly unusual <laughs> so there they are again this is only a selection she just sent me a couple of her prints just as a thank you which was really sweet of her thank you mickey I love this one. So I'm going to get myself some six by six frames and have a good old play with these, sorting out how to put them in an order that I can, the best order to enjoy them in. Um, go and check out her links, like I say, in the description down below. Uh, you'll find all of her links to, she's mostly on Instagram. She's very active on Instagram. She's like me. Oh, that won't stay up now. There you go. Uh, she's like me, she's very active on Instagram, she posts virtually every day. So go show her some love, tell her I sent you. Uh, and thanks for joining me for Vlogmas Day 8, which is late, very sedate, and under 10 minutes. Are you impressed? Question from the thingy, are you doing Witchy Wednesdays anymore? Um, yes and no. Not specifically, I've incorporated my witchy stuff into everything else I do. So I don't specifically do. That's been part of my word of the year this year, doing um, trans transmogrification of my stuff from being, this is art journaling and this is teaching and this is what I do arty when I'm not teaching and this is what I do for witchy stuff. And I've pushed it all together and said no, nope, no more. I don't have lots of little boxes that I put myself in anymore. I am a witchy, gothy, arty, journaly, plannery painter, mixed media artist thing. Cosmic shiz, as Luna says. <laughs> Cosmic shiz, that's what we do. Cosmic shiz. Join me tomorrow for some more cosmic shiz. Now tomorrow is Sunday and I don't normally work Sundays so I need to think of something to do tomorrow that's not going to be too intense or take too long. I have no idea what I'm going to do but I will think of something. So thanks for joining me for this super quick one. Still under 10 minutes. Thank you and I will see you again tomorrow. Bye!